Yeshayahu, Isaiah 19. The burden of Mitzrayim. Behold, Yahuwah rides upon a swift cloud and shall come into Mitzrayim. And the idols of Mitzrayim shall be moved at his presence. And the heart of Mitzrayim shall melt in the midst of it. And I will set the Mitzrayim against the Mitzrayim. And they shall fight everyone against his brother and everyone against his neighbor, city against city, and kingdom against kingdom. And the Ruach of Mitzrayim shall fail in the midst thereof. And I will destroy the counsel thereof, and they shall seek to the idols and to the charmers and to them that have familiar spirits and to the wizards. And at the Mitzrim will I give over into the hand of a cruel lord. And a fierce king shall rule over them, says Adonai, Yahuwah Sevaoth. And the waters shall fail from the sea. And the river shall be wasted and dried up. And they shall turn the rivers far away. And the brooks of defense shall be emptied and dried up. The reeds and flags shall wither. The paper reeds by the brooks, by the mouth of the brooks, and everything sown by the brooks shall wither, be driven away, and be no more. The fishers also shall mourn, and all they that cast angle into the brooks shall lament. And they that spread nets upon the waters shall languish. Moreover, they that work in fine flax, and they that weave networks, shall be confounded. And they shall be broken in the purposes thereof. All that makes sluices and ponds for fish. Surely the princes of Sa'an are fools. The counsel of the wise counselors of Pharaoh is become brutish. How say ye unto Pharaoh, I am the son of the wise, the son of ancient kings? Where are they? Where are your wise men? And let them tell you now, and let them know that Yahuwah Savaot has purposed upon Mitzrayim. The princes of Soan are become fools. The princes of Nof are deceived. They have also seduced Eth Mitzrayim, even they that are the stay of the tribes thereof. Yahuwah has mingled a perverse ruach in the midst thereof, and they have caused Eth Mitzrayim to err in every work thereof, as a drunken man staggers in his vomit. Neither shall there be any work for Mitzrayim, which the herd or tail, rather which the head or tail, branch or rush may do. In that day shall Mitzrayim be like unto women, and it shall be afraid and fear because of the shaking of the hand of Yahuwah Sevaoth, which he shakes over it. And the land of Yahuda shall be a terror unto Mitzrayim, Every one that makes mention thereof shall be afraid in himself because of the counsel of Yahuwah Sevaoth, which he has determined against it. In that day shall five cities in the land of Mitzrayim speak the language of Canaan and swear to Yahuwah Sevaoth. One shall be called the City of Destruction. In that day shall there be an altar to Yahuwah in the midst of the land of Mitzrayim and a pillar at the border thereof to Yahuwah. And it shall be for a sign and for a witness unto Yahuwah Sevaoth in the land of Mitzrayim. For they shall cry unto El Yahuwah because of the oppressors and he shall send them a savior and a great one and he shall deliver them. And Yahuwah shall be known to Mitzrayim, 
and the Mitzrayim shall know Eth Yahuwah in that day, and shall do sacrifice and oblation. Yea, they shall vow a vow unto Yahuwah and perform it. And Yahuwah shall smite Eth Mitzrayim. He shall smite and heal it. And they shall return even to Yahuwah and he shall be entreated of them, and shall heal them. In that day shall there be a highway out of Mitzrayim to Ashshurah, and Ashshur shall come into Mitzrayim, and the Mitzrayim into Ashshur, and the Mitzrayim shall serve with eth the Ashsharim. In that day shall Yashadael be the third with Mitzrayim and with Ashshur, even a blessing in the midst of the land. Whom Yahuwah Sevaoth shall bless, saying, Blessed be Mitzrayim, my people, and Ashshur, the work of my hands, and Yashadael, my inheritance.